Manny Machado is one of the best players who ever lived. I, I find he's in the top well, 100 players who ever lived. Really? Who? Yeah, I You're, really believe that's, that. Yeah, it, that's now that's getting a lot. Whoa, of whoa, whoa, Michael, 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 you all right? I'm telling you, the guy's a great player. But you just said he's I, I, one of the greatest players who ever lived. He is. You sound like you're losing your, your marbles over he there. He is one of the best players who ever lived. Most talented players who ever lived? Yeah, but, I, I mean, am I saying the Yankees should get him? Not at the price that he wants. But to, for, for, for people to say, I'd rather have Andujar than Machado, that's all about your love for a homegrown player. Well, and also, Manny Machado is a great player. I just want to say RIP to Michael's Twitter but, mentions. Uh, I just find it, you're right. Machado is better, and it's unfair because one's a rookie and one's established himself as a big-time major leaguer. But we keep circling back to the fact the Yankees didn't play him in that pivotal game. He's not an A-plus defender. He made 15 errors last year. But Machado also is the guy that didn't hustle and turned that, triples into that's, singles. You absolutely, that's a different story, and that cheapens him. I right. agree. I agree. That's why I wouldn't be so on board if they signed him. But to diminish him as a player, the actual talent that he brings to the game, you don't see that every generation. That's how good he is. No, People I, don't get it. He's great. Right, and you have Andujar, who's also... Maybe not as great as Machado, but is young, affordable, already on your roster, contributed to a 100-win season, right. and can grow into Machado without having to spend possibly I, 10 years I, worth I, of money on him. I will tell you this, Donnie. It's not easy to go into Machado. Again, one of the greatest players ever. Just in the six-year period, the things he's done over his first six years, not many people in baseball history have done that in the first six years. And the other stuff makes me hold my nose. It's disgusting that he can't run hard to first. It's disgusting that he turned, in the World Series, a ball off the wall into a single. I get all of that, and that cheapens him. But I'm just looking at pure, unadulterated talent. Not many people come along like this guy.